I live inside my own world of make-believe Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities I see the world through ice covered in ink and bleach Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watched me weep I love everything Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe But that's alright Kids screaming in the craters for fantasies Some days I skate and it should be So had you not quit, where would you be right now? What does consistency look like on your life? Do you keep going just when you're winning, just when you're feeling good? Just when you're motivated and inspired? Are you motivated or are you dedicated? There's a difference Or do you need to keep watching YouTube videos and listening to stuff like this to get you going again? Are you dedicated to what it is you're called to do? What does consistency look like on your life? And had you not quit, where would you be right now? They say hindsight is 2020. Man, if I knew then what I know now. Well, guess what? You know now what you should know then. You know it right now. chest with the cable and I'm pulling this way pushing actually I'm pushing I'm not pushing and then chest up head up and then squeeze can't squeeze good stretch that's the good thing with this one it's a really big stretch and then a nice squeeze so first we did this way right but now I'm turning straight chest up head up and I'm kneeing down and then I can push this way you see this way or technically with my elbow up, but now we keep the elbow in and we're just doing this one. Hey brother, you remember when I told you about elbows together? You remember? This machine is trying to imitate this quite well. It's actually now me pushing only with my elbows and I'm having a super nice squeeze and I'm having a super good stretch either. What does this tell us, bro? This point is very important for our chest training and it, like I said, it imitates this pushing your elbows together to get a harder squeeze on your pecs. Try it. Brother, I want you to try this one thing. Take your elbow, bring it up and squeeze your chest. 
and you can definitely feel that the upper chest is contracting more. Then you bring your elbow completely down and you squeeze. I mean, it's easy to see here. You see, it looks like from bottom up, looks like from the top down. So it teaches us we have to have all these different variations. Where I'm putting my elbow here is really affecting the way of my chest contracting. So be smart and have your elbow in the right position, brother, and practice what fits the best for you and your body composition.